Assalamu alaikum viewers. This short video is on the design ideas of a fisherman visitor center in a seaside village of East Malaysia. Enjoy! The initiative of the project is to create an interactive platform for the locals and tourists to understand and engage in the life and culture of a fisherman. Site B is located at Kampung Sabarang Balok. As you can see, Site B is adjacent to the canal of Sunai Balok. It is nestled amidst nature and away from the hustle and bustle of the village. The strength of the site is that it is, under, is an underdeveloped land with 360 degrees good views, plenty of natural features such as large casuarina trees, kangkong lao, and baby mangrove trees with direct access to the riverbank. The path on the top right is the direct access from the village of Kampung Sabarak Balok. The concept, the concept for this the concept for this design is sentiments towards nature. The concept was derived on the site based on the atmosphere of the natural setting. This concept captures the environment a fish that a fisherman works in. The concept influences a building design as it advocates minimum intervention to the site to rejuvenate the ecology of the flora and fauna and existing topography of the water and vegetation. The concept of sentiments towards nature reflects the calm and serenity of the environment in order for the visitors to feel what the environment of a fisherman's lifestyle is like. I will be using uh, horizontal and vertical circulation on the site to control the disruptive movement. These can then form interlocking spaces that can be stacked to create levels. This can create facades that face the best views, which are the treescape, the sea view, the canal view, and the fisherman facilities views. Lastly, the spaces can be tied together with an external platform to allow visitors maximum outdoor experience. Voids are formed to bring the outdoors into the internal spaces to allow the visitors to engage with the sand and, and the The precedent study is the Wabi Sabi Tea House by Kwavu Architects. This architecture influenced me as it has a more minimist, minimalistic and tranquil approach to design in a natural setting. This would be perfect to highlight the focus on fisherman activities and provide a peaceful atmosphere to unwind. The site planning discusses the basic layout of the required spaces such as the parking, the main spaces, and the commercial spaces as well as the fisherman facility which is located at the existing jetty. So the spatial organization shows the bubble diagram of the connections between spaces which are mostly public and the private spaces which are the office and the stores. This is the initial floor plan idea where once the visitors enter from the main village road they are greeted with the parking when they can conveniently park, they can access the, the entrance to a flat path. After the entrance, they will, they will step into the reception. And from the reception, they can be immediately, um, immediately directed to the commercial area where they can purchase souvenirs and dry items. And the center here is the sunken courtyard. This, uh, as you can see, tr the trees that are existing on the site can come out through this sunken courtyard, bring the nature into the environment of the internal spaces. Following the commercial area, the, view the visitors are then exposed to the performance deck. This performance deck is ha has direct access to the river, 
riverbank as well as the best views which are the sea views and the river view the performance deck is adjacent to the lounge which is crucial in this design for visitors to relax and enjoy the environment following that you have the private washroom the blue border around shows the trails that connect all the spaces externally which then leads them to the fisherman's facilities such as a workshop which then further leads off to the jetty this is the ground floor there is an ex another parking lot here which is private for the uh, staff on the upstairs we have the surau the gallery the dining the washroom and the kitchen these have the best views the dining and the gallery have the best views as they are the main spaces the strategies that i intend to use in my design are an open courtyard that can allow um, access to all the spaces and also bring the nature into the space and lastly ra raised wooden trails so that uh, in order to preserve the natural setting and also the flora and fauna of, of the place so the build the strategy is to stilt the building and also use wooden trails